Colon cancer is a deadly disease that, thanks to screening tools, can be prevented and cured if caught early. One of the current ways to look for cancer or precancerous polyps is with colonoscopy. That's the test during which doctors use a scope to spot and remove polyps, which they send to a lab for diagnosis. But now, a new technology allows doctors to determine if you have precancerous polyps without having to remove them first. Doctors at Mayo Clinic say it could save many people from having unnecessary biopsies. As a gift to himself, John Levchuk got a head-to-toe physical exam. It included a colonoscopy. They took out 20 different polyps. The only way John's doctors could tell whether or not the colon polyps were precancerous was to remove them and send them to a pathology lab for diagnosis. Polyp biopsies are a very good way of diagnosing cancer, but studies show that half of them don't need to be taken out because they're benign. Research at Mayo Clinic shows that a new technology can detect and diagnose colon polyps without having to remove any tissue from the body. This new uh, virtual biopsy technique would allow us to look at polyps very precisely while they're still in the colon and make a diagnosis if it's precancerous or not precancerous. Here's how it works. Dr. Michael Wallace guides a colonoscope equipped with a camera and a tiny probe-based microscope into the colon. Once there, he can identify polyps and use the microscope to look at individual cells. If the cells look normal, the polyp can stay. If it does have precancerous changes, he can take it out and prevent it from developing into cancer. Uh, this sample is almost certainly a cancerous sample, not even a precancer. Dr. Wallace says the technology may eliminate the need for unnecessary biopsies and benign polyp removal. And that's good news for the thousands of people like John who get screened for colon cancer every few years. Another potential advantage that Dr. Wallace is studying now is cost savings that could arise from not having to perform so many biopsies. And John says he knows colon cancer screening saves lives, and he hopes this technology will encourage more people to have the procedure. This technology is being considered for use for other types of cancer screening as well. For Medical Edge, I'm Vivian Williams.